viewers welcome to engineering study materials today we are going to discuss about the brake drum so what is this it is a braking device which consists of a brake linings which exert on the wheel rim so that the vehicle can be stopped easily it consists of the two braking shoes or linings that is primary and secondary the part is actually made up of a cast iron so that it can exerts or it can absorb most amount of the heat that is produced during the operation so that the vehicle can be last for a long life it may consists of a cooling fins that is when we apply some sort of a braking operation the wheel rim gets heated so the heat has to be escaped from the wheel rim so that cooling fins can be used see in this diagram it is a small first one is a small wheel rim and second one is a somewhat big wheel rim and this is our braking drum with this is the cooling fins for the heavy vehicle this is for the small vehicle such as two wheelers and it consists of the some major parts such as calipers for the movement of the uh, brake linings so that it can oppose or force on the wheel rim or a drum brake so that the vehicle can stop easily it consists of an anchor that is attached to it and wheel cylinder this is the major part where the hydraulic fluid goes into it and pushes the caliper to make the brake linings to force on the brake drum then let's see about the operation when the hydraulic fluid or some mechanisms pushes the uh, braking caliper it opposes or forces the braking linings to the brake drum so that the brake drum attached to the wheel is stopped this is a graph that is a braking line brake lining coefficient of friction that is when we apply some sort of a brake the heat or the heating due to friction is increased this is a friction coefficient and surface temperature graph at temperature that is minimal there is much amount of friction coefficient but when the heat increases uh, rapidly or gradually anything else the friction coefficient is comes down drastically this is due to the uh, property of the material that if a material is at low temperature it becomes a it may uh, act as a solid but it when it uh, goes to the certain higher amount of temperature it loses its property and becomes soft in nature so that the friction will decreases drastically so finally brake drum is a rotating friction surface that the brake lining contacts they are made of cast iron and withstand high temperature and absorb lot of heat and maintain its shape because shape is the major criteria in the wheel as well as the brake drum to enhance the proper driving generally these are made up of a centrifugal casting process because when we make a cylindrical object it is the best way to produce it and most of the cylindrical liners cast in pipes gun barrels pressure vessels can also be used to uh, make this use of centrifugal casting process so this is a short video friends if you like this video put a thumbs up and share this video to your friends to gain knowledge and don't forget to subscribe this channel for more videos so thank you for watching